I'm going to show you how to make my go-to chocolate sauce and then give it some very distinctive Mexican flavors. I have a very bittersweet chocolate here that I'm going to put into a saucepan. Add to that a cupful of cream and a quarter cup of agave syrup. Turn on the heat to medium and whisk it until it all comes together. Turn the temperature to low, and I'm going to measure into the pot a little bit of Mexican canela, that true cinnamon, the kind that you can find in the Mexican grocery stores. Of course, regular, regular cinnamon would work too, but it doesn't have quite the same flowery aroma. And then a couple of teaspoons of Mexican vanilla. Also more on the flowery side of flavor than what you will find in a lot of other kinds of vanilla. All of that gets whisked together, giving that sort of traditional Mexican chocolate flavor of vanilla and cinnamon. I'm going to let this cool off completely, and then I'm going to make it into a drink, but a drink that just might surprise you. So this drink is, well, it's a little like a chocolate margarita. Start with an ounce and a half of tequila, just like you're making a margarita. Pour in half an ounce of creme de cacao. A half ounce of agave syrup goes in next. And finally, add a half ounce of our homemade chocolate sauce. And then stir everything together. Moisten the rim of a martini glass with some water and then place the glass in a mixture of sugar and Mexican canela. Next, fill the shaker with ice and shake vigorously for about 15 seconds. Dessert anyone? 